what the actual <laughs> you serious <laughs> what are they doing the cloning the pope <laughs> oh <laughs> my god <laughs> somehow pope benedict returns <laughs> hello everyone we're back we're back and looking schnazzy too i like your dress kid thank you it's the same one i wear every single time we record this sh this show is called narrative noir so i'm gonna be a little more narrative noir -y. Ooh, getting a little detective flair in there well yeah listen this show might be funny we make the memes we make the jokes mm. but we want to be a reanalysis of shows and that's what we're gonna do yes and what better way to come back than the comeback of the hell of a boss the full moon. Is it going to be a hell of an episode or a hell of a disappointment? It's a full moon. Like when someone goes to moon you and accidentally shows you their black hole. Move forward. <laughs> and without a single other word, the episode just starts. <laughs> Yes, it's um, indeed for mature audiences. Is it though? Rampant demon horniness. Is it though? I do love the. Oh <laughs> uh, no! Hold on, hold on. I need a musical where like someone pukes on stage and then just starts singing the perfect notes. I mean, you kind of already got it, so. I want it live, Bryce Pinkham. Do it, you coward. Oh God, he's having an existential crisis. <laughs> I swore I wouldn't dwell on the divorce. Aren't me on a daily basis? What, what were you saying? You like the what? The... Oh, I just love his aesthetic. Like, the celestial aesthetic. It's so nice. And I am not biased towards pink and purple and blue. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, the delusion's too big. I, I love his, like, wet feather hair look. I don't know why. See him tonight. All right, all right. The horses! The horses! The horses never leave. Wait a second. Why is his own face crossed out? Oh, where, wait, wait, where was that? Was on all the, the portraits. Yeah, look at all the portraits. His own face is scribbled out. Wow, that is uh, severe self loathing. <laughs> He's out of Xanax. Oh, He's like, no. oh, God. <laughs> oh, Looney. I'll fucking die alone if this goes bad. Oh! Well, the stakes are real high. Am I doing something I can't take back? Relax. Would he want me if he was free? Uh huh. Fine. Yeah, that's the that's the look of a sane person. I just love that you have a Broadway star like Bryce Pinkham juxtaposed against Brandon Rogers, just trying to lie to himself. Yeah, that's yeah. But isn't that kind of the point? Like they're opposites, technically. Yes. Oh oh. <laughs> Why? Okay, this is the thing I like though about the world building is the other imps are like, dude, chill out. <laughs> it's it's just stolas. I know it's hell, but come on. Will it please him, or will I just be fucking it all up? Oh, I love that background. It looks so cool. Listen, I know where this is going because it's been in the background of other episodes. But that's the problem. It's been in the background of other episodes. Wait, where are we now? Are we in the human realm now? Yeah, this is definitely. Oh. My baby! <laughs> <laughs> Ducks! What? Oh, yeah. Marky! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, that's. Ah, oh, that's visceral. That hurts me. Oh my god. Did he just oh, scoop baby, the ice cream off the floor? You. Yeah. No yeah, he need, did. I was just in the and right it has place, hair in it. Right <gasps> oh, the cherubs. I was wondering who was in disguise here. Oh, they are the cherubs. How'd we do, Cletus? Okay, Mickey Mouse. No, I was hoping his voice would be like the baby from Roger Rabbit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just think, he's been in the human world for so long, and so just like, 50 fucking bucks, baby. That would have been funnier, honestly. If they'd gotten the original voice actor for Husk, would have been perfect. I mean, that wouldn't have been too hard, I don't think. So I think salvation's worth, worth 20 bucks and a queen's nose. Uh, they're fucking cod. <laughs> <laughs> just went full Brooklyn. I just... Uh... Well, then quiet your <gasps> incessant whinging oh. and get back under that coat. Don't hit him. Wait, what is his name again? Oh. It's uh, So it's Cletus. Colin, Colin. Colin is the sheep, yeah. Colin and who's the other one? The girl. Mm -hmm. 
I'm looking it up. We ask the questions here. It's my favorite man. Never start with the head. The victim gets all fuzzy. He can't feel the neck. See? What <laughs> boss? This guy. Hey, that's a pretty good drawing, honestly. Better than all the other drawings they have of Blitz. You know that? Peanut heads? So that's his name. Peanuts heads? Wait, what? I think maybe we can help each other out here. They didn't say what I thought they said, did they? They said peanut, right? Yep. Uh, Keeney, by the way. So it's Keeney, Cletus, and... And Colin. Colin? What a great fucking day this is. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Billy? Beautiful bloody mess in there. Anyhow, that was our obligatory Millie show up in the episode. Oof. We won't see her the rest of the episode. Well, it's the, first of all, fuck you. It's the full moon. Why does that cactus have a, a fedora? What, Cactuar can't have a fedora? I have several quits. A few months? I just, is he gonna uh, tip his hat and say, m'lady? I hope not. It's the full moon tonight, but you don't have to come if you don't want to, Blitzy. <laughs> TMI, sir. <laughs> I'm, I'm Moxie. I'm Moxie. <laughs> oh, shit. He's getting bored of you. What? Yeah, Love it, Luna. Just just play into your dad's insecurities. That's what black. teenagers do. They give you yeah, to ditch. fair, they fair. Want out well, she's not even a teenager. She's, she's, she's like a young adult, I guess. She's gone now. Because I do that all the time. Cannon, Luna gets more action than you do. Well, tits. I do Feels kind like of feel bad about tonight. Luna's character, worry, though, because I feel like she just keeps backtracking and not, like, growth, and then all of a sudden it just disappears. And it would be disastrous to lose what we worked for now. So fucking good, sir. That got me. I don't know why. Okay, girl up, Mox. That's what adults do. We're horny. Oh, 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 no. Oh, God. Actually, recent studies show that most of the youth is less horny than adults. They just don't like media with romantic relationships. We prefer just, you know, good storytelling. I've been on the internet too long. We lay in wait for them to return to Earth. So we might smite them once and for all. Guys, talking to Ow! Leave my boy alone. He's just trying to be good. What do you mean? Colin's just a sheep. Oh. But I like Colin. Aw, oh, look at all the budget they got. You don't even know his name. I had to look I, it up. I listen, <laughs> I struggle with what the actual <laughs> you serious? <laughs> What are they doing? The cloning the Pope? <laughs> oh <laughs> my god! <laughs> Somehow Pope Benedict returns. <laughs> this bad boy will allow us to open a door straight into hell. Where we plan on eliminating the demonic threat before they can tarnish this great What is their uh company name well, uh, or whatever? Dweebs? No, it's not dweeb. It does start with the D, but dummies. Do. Why do I keep thinking of Goober? I don't know. I'm a goofy Goober! So far, we've only been able to open the portal about two feet in diameter. And we can't very well send children after last time. What? What? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Those goddamn American heroes. F American heroes. Oh, <laughs> uh, boy. Wanna, Wanna help, help us hunt some demon scum? scum? Oh, I love the mech suits, though. Very Gurren Lagann. Hey, Gurren Lagann is one of the uh, best um, animes ever done on made. The glasses in particular. Ah, uh, I love her outfit. <laughs> <laughs> Not you. <laughs> He's dejectedly walking away in the suit. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good cut. Good work, editor. That, good work. That was a good cut. Welcome, little one. What can I interest you in today? Alex Brightman, is that you again? You should get an Alex Brightman tally counter. Max Horny. They're all horny. What's the mood? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't know why that got me. Listen, I know there's a lot of sex jokes in this, but I feel like it's still not as lewd as a Beetlejuice with a representative in it. Politics! 
about that. They tend to not really give a shit. Hey, there's a whole store there. It's just boobs. And step on me. Sweet heavens, what kind of store is this? Oh no, the cherubs are gonna get into sex things. A sicko! <laughs> His <laughs> eyes! Spaces. What is that? Hello, Hello uh, fellow Please vile hell beast. Cletus is literally just bootleg Mickey Mouse. Oh, but like the Mickey Mouse from the new Mickey Mouse TV show. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking. Do you have any harshly worded bumper stickers? Uh, or something? <laughs> Colin's face too. Meanwhile, at at us, Oh, I really love his. I love his rainbow pants. Tonight, He's ready for Pride Month. Oh, oh, oh no. <laughs> I don't like that keypad, Rob. I do like that they uh, rekindled their friendship, but that makes me happy. That shot was amazing. And if you're feeling really frisky, we have the new Dragon Driller 5000. Oh. Now with vibration. Ah! Wait, wait. Now with vibration? Are you telling me that it didn't have a vibration function before? Osmodus, you got to step it up. The human realm is on top. I I'll stop. I'll stop. I'm sorry. I, I, um, no, no, I don't you're right. It's to, fine. It's I, okay. I don't need to know any of this information. I just don't want to say something that someone will just take up the butt, so. <laughs> I keep coughing. Dear God. <laughs> the Mickey Mouse face. <laughs> face. For the humans, for the heavens, and most of all for us. Yeah, exactly. They're being selfish because all they want is to go back. But they're doing it in the wrong way. Millie! Where's my bow tie wearing Virgo? And you weren't exactly covert. Oh, he's right there. You got a lot of nerve. Oh, I love the glow on the, the eyes. It's so good. That's right. I caught you staring at the furry's butt. Rob. What? Not again. No, you don't, bitch. Luna just grabbed a 50 cal rifle, lifted the barrel, hey, and she's asshole. fine. Hold on. Did they do the pick up the petty joke? Yes, they did. Oh my gosh. <laughs> What kind of gun is that? Hold on, I have questions. Sorry, hun. You can play as me, but that don't mean you're anywhere close. Millie versus Mecha Millie. <laughs> Mecha Millie. Fight! Ah, there we go. We gotta make Millie the damsel in distress for no reason. Yeah, I don't know why they do that. She's capable as is. Welcome to hell, bitch. Why was that out of character for Moxie? Yeah, that's out of character. And to be perfectly honest, the voice line sounded weird. I think he just wasn't, because it wasn't a Moxie type line. It was weird for him. Also, never mind. I take it back. Millie is very capable. Ooh, ouch. You know, I'm okay with any excuse to show human Luna. Oh, you simp. Hey, only for Millie. See, that's me falling for her. <laughs> Are they going to start making out? Oh yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, there they go. Gotta get, got to get the call back. <laughs> Luna wins the day for this one. Oh, so, how to go? Why is he still in the Luna verse? He's adorable in the Luna verse. Heidi ha hoo ha stole this. Heidi ha hoo ha. <laughs> Guess what I got for us. And got lots of okay, the music is doing a lot of work right now. Like, give this man's back a break. Like this extra Because it's making all this seem just awkward. Like... Just awkward. I like his little, uh, Do you have my book, like, fancier outfit. Yeah, his royal outfit. Oh, Solus's, yeah, but I was talking about Blitz's. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. I need it back. Permanently. No, 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 no. Hold on, Stolas. Come on. I'm bitch, you know I don't disappoint. I also no, no, love no, that no, Stolas' no expressions are, made up like, my mind. his other eyes do a lot of expression. Mm -hmm. I need this book, Stolas. I will do anything. Oh. This is an Asmodian crystal. If only this hadn't been a, a background, background plot. I'm not surprised by that. <laughs> you will be able to go anywhere you want in the human realm without breaking demon law. <gasps> Stop! No, the other book was a pirate. It was a hook. Like hook as Peter in- Peter Pan live. Oh no! Wait, where is Christian Borrell when I need him? Perhaps you should sit and like a mother hen, hatch your plot. I don't understand. Why are you giving me this? Uh-oh. I'm giving you this because I care. This transactional thing we have it's not right anymore. It hasn't been. 
It never was. Oh, this makes me love Stolas more, by the way. But I want you to continue to be who you are. Your business. Aw. You don't have to stay here with me. But I want you to. Him removing his hat right there is a is a show of vulnerability. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right, you're fucking with me. This is God an damn it, Blitz! Every time one, it, he has to lie oh, because he cannot oh, accept so genuine so feelings. But like he accepted genuine feelings with Fizz. It took a lot of time, though. I love you so much. I... Thank you, Blitz. I wish you the best with your business. Wait, what? You are serious? The, it's it's an oh, imposter oh, syndrome that Blitz what fights with, right? He he feels that no one he doesn't believe he's worthy of anyone else, and therefore how could they ever think that that he's worth anything? You needn't say anything. And I, I get that, but I feel so like th this is what frustrates me about this kind of writing. It feels too contrived. No, I get it. it. It's blowing up a little too fast for me. Can I get a fucking minute to? Think after everything you put me through, you pompous, rich asshole. I listen. I think what Stola said was good. It's just that definitely. I mean, you royal um, fucks think you can do this every time. Like you can just play with our feelings because we're smaller and not as important. Stolas was. It was very unfair to expect an answer without being honest. Well, I'm not letting you, bitch. Let's go. That's one heck of an outburst. Blitz, I think so very highly of you. I didn't realize you think so low of me. <laughs> oh. So let's wait. I'm serious. What the fuck? So right now we're in this this loop. I'm starting to feel it. I'm starting to feel the fatigue. I felt it last episode, honestly, but... I think, yeah. I think the problem is we started with this show that was really fun, whimsical, and world building and great. And I want it to be character-driven. I know what direction I want to go, but we've reached Guarma. We've reached Days of Our Lives <laughs> soap opera. <laughs> we've reached Guarma. We'll keep watching as long... Uh, even though it makes Kit cry, <sighs> as you hear... We'll keep watching. Uh, just like this video down below. Com and and we want to hear your input. Comment what you think of Hell of a Boss, right? Also, let us know what indie animations are coming up that you guys would like to watch us to or watch. Like to like for. Oh, I can't speak. Would like us to watch. And if you think we should give Hell of a Boss more of a try as well, like this video. Get it to, to 5,000 likes and we will watch more Hell of a Boss. Um, or, you know, you can always hit this button right here. You know, this will, uh, this guy here will help you subscribe. And uh, over here is the, uh, is a video I picked for you. And this is one the algorithm sent you. There's a 80% chance you'll enjoy this video. Do you yeah, trust right the there. algorithm? I trust you, viewer. Oh, bye-bye! <laughs>